Hey everybody, this is Reggie Laurent, master colorist, and I'm getting ready to sew another one of the pieces in my Life and Love series. I promised you guys that I'd show you a few more. And once again, what I'm going to do is go ahead and put the thread on the negative. That's all of the black you see between all of the colors. Once again, all of these colors, all of these shapes are geometric and organic, and they're all independent of each other. No two shapes intersect. So what I'm getting ready to do is, is cordon every shape off with what I call my thread. This is a mixture of Liquitex Titanium White, Gel Medium, and Liquitex Varnish. And I mix it to a consistency so that I can squeeze it and it stays raised as you'll see. So every shape you see here will be uh, once again cordoned off. And uh, this is the last step in the series. There is absolutely no white in these paintings until I add the thread. So that's what I'm going to do. And I take my time with this. It's, um, you know, once again, this is the final step in the process. So if you get a blob or, you know, if, you're, um, if your hand isn't steady or if the mix isn't just right, uh, then it won't come out right. So as you can see, this is just flowing and I'm just following the negative. Now, of course, I put my little twists and turns in there. That makes it a lot more interesting. And I do this with every single one in my DNA series. This again is another one in the series I call Life and Love. Go to LaurentOriginals.com and you'll see the Life and Love series. There are 50 pieces uploaded and I am actually working on nine more. So this one will be available too. The original will be available, as well as G. Clay's. These are some that I print in open edition, so um, uh, everybody can have them, and they, they look good in multiple. So if you want to order more than one, that's perfectly fine. But as you can see, once again, the thread is just for the negative. I'll stop that right there, and then pick it back up. Do a little twirl there and bring this on around. So this is my favorite part mostly because it signifies that the painting is almost done. And once again it takes about two days uh, for this to really cure completely because this is thick. This is you know uh, as you can see and it will dry in this raised position. And this is actually very expensive. The mixture of the paint, the gel medium, and the varnish is fairly expensive. Uh, paint supplies are really going through the roof lately. But I do not skimp on materials, and that's how come I can get the outcome that I want consistently every time. Once you start going to inferior materials, you're gonna make inferior art. Uh, thank you, Aaron Henderson, for teaching me that early in my career. And that's something that I stress to other artists. There are places where you may be able to skimp a little. Uh, pain is not one of those places. It's just not. And as you can see, it completely transforms the pain. Um, once again, because there is, it's completely devoid of white up until I sew it. And once again, every shape is cordoned off. That way they can all be individuals like people. So in a way, each one of these is like its own little painting. And as you can see, see every single shape is self-contained. So I will take these to the end. That's the last thing that I have to do. Uh, and make sure that everything is, is buttoned down. This is looking pretty good. So yeah, it's Friday night, working on life and love. And there's another one for you. I've got several more of these to do, and I will uh, show you. Once again, this is how they start out. These are some that I blocked in tonight, so I'm working on some more. Uh, and the finished product is like that. Thanks again for watching. Don't forget, LaurentOriginals.com if you want to order some G. Clays. And follow me on Laurent Originals on Instagram. Y'all have a good day.